March of 2020, then Macomb County Prosecutor Eric Smith turning himself in, charged with misconduct in office and racketeering. The Attorney General accusing him of running a criminal enterprise, alleging he embezzled $600,000 in county forfeiture funds. Nearly two pandemic years later, the case still hasn't gone to trial. Attorneys arguing at Friday's preliminary examination about Smith's home surveillance system he's accused of paying for with drug forfeiture money. I just remember seeing a uh, white male on a bicycle. A retired Macomb County deputy sheriff testifying that back in 2012, he stopped and questioned a man on a bicycle in the early morning hours outside Eric Smith's subdivision. But the cyclist was cooperative and not detained. He was out on Romeo Plank um, right near the entrance to um, the subdivision where Eric Smith lived. They sent him on his way. Defense attorneys calling Sheriff Anthony Wickersham as well, who testified he called Eric Smith at the time to let him know, but it wasn't discussed again until Smith was the one being investigated, and he contacted Wickersham to ask if there was a police report from back in 2012. I was asked there was a report there. If I could find the date and time, this so why does a seemingly meaningless midnight bicycle rider back in 2012 even matter? The assistant attorney general says it doesn't. There's nothing that Eric Smith would fear uh, regarding some unknown bicyclist. Smith's defense attorney firing back. People are probably asking, well, what's he doing with the security system? Here's essentially the reason. But that was not enough for the prosecution, instead asking the sheriff about his own home security system and how he paid for it. You didn't have the drug forfeiture funds pay for that. Your office controls, did you? No. Why? This is improper? Objection. The defense objecting the prosecutor going after Eric Smith. Judge, mm -hmm. what we've got here is He's arguing somehow it was reasonable for an unknown bicyclist to be out on the main road and for him to pay for with drug forfeiture funds, public money, his own personal home security system, among other things that he had installed in his house. A testy exchange, but no conclusion. The preliminary examination that started in July continues on February 4th. Meantime, Eric Smith is scheduled for sentencing in federal court for obstruction of justice at the end of this month. In Macomb County, Amy Lang, Fox 2 News.